calculating monthly payments using the finance application. I made a video not too long ago with this formula for calculating monthly payment. And what I did with this formula is I went and made a program on the TI-84 plus graphing calculator. And a friend of mine, Mr. Sebastian, informed me that our TI-84 plus calculator has an application that will take care of this with a lot less effort. And here I'm going to bring a TI Smart View to view where we can see our calculator. And if we go ahead and press the Apps key, we can see at the very top the Finance application. What we're going to do is view the application and we're going to get to it by pressing Enter. And what we use is we use the TVM Solver option one will help us do this. We press Enter and what we have is we're asked these different, uh, uh, they call it a five key format. I don't know why it's exactly five. But we can go ahead and put in the data for whatever we're examining and figure out what's happening. So let's say we want to buy a, a house and the number of payments is going to be with a 12 months in a year, we're going to put in 15 times 12. And so we enter, so we get 180 payments. We're going to get a 6% interest rate, so we put in 6% right here. And the present value is going to be this value of the house, 150,000. 50. Okay, so we have 150,000 dollars. And next we're going to go here to payment. That's what we don't know. But our future value is going to be zero. We say future value because that's when it's going to be paid off. Next we come down here to payments per year. We're going to go for 12 payments per year. And when we enter that, we see that automatically the compounding per year goes ahead and and automatically sets by default. And now we're going to go up to what we're trying to calculate, which is the payment. So we go up here, back up here, and we use the solver method. Now the solver, you see the solver right above the enter key here, we get to by pressing the alpha key and then the enter key. And what that does is it gives us this negative $1,265.79. And so that's going to be our monthly payment to pay off this $150,000 loan over 15 years at a 6% interest rate. So um, that's a lot easier than programming the way I did in that earlier video. Let's go ahead and look at another application, this one buying a car. So we go over here and we have a car price. We want to have a loan of $19,000 at an annual percentage rate of 7.5 percent and over a term of four years. So we go back to our TI Smart View and we're going to change the parameters accordingly. Our n is going to be, uh, it's going to be 4 times 12 and we should know that that's 48 already but we don't have to know that so it's 48. Our interest rate is going to be 7.5 so we put in 7.5 and then we go down to uh, payment. Well, we don't know what that is. So we're going to leave that alone. Our future value is going to be zero. And we have our payments per year at 12 and the compounded periods per year also 12. So we go back up here and our present value, for, almost forgot that one, $19,000. So we change that to 19000 Okay, we go back here to payment. And now let's go ahead and solve or touch the solver by pressing alpha, then enter. So we get monthly payments of $459.40. I hope this has been helpful. Thanks for viewing.